it's 4.30 in the morning. That clock is off. Sits. We should jump in the ice bath. Let's do it. I'm teaching him how to wake up in the morning. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> so it's hot, too early. A little tired, as you can see. Uh, but one of my favorite things to do, no matter what time it is, when you wake up, is to just do a dip in the ice bath. You just go in. You gotta unplug it. Yeah, it's gonna be a little snowy, but. What happens is um, it just really wakes up the muscles, takes down inflammation, and it's uh, super nice. seconds or so. This is gonna be super loud, but the froth levels are gonna be insane. Your shirt's on backwards and upside down. Upside down? <laughs> <laughs> How do you put a shirt on upside down? <laughs> Just stoked because today is going to be a good day. We've been up since 2 a.m. Me and my girlfriend Jess because we have a kitten and it's goes meow. <coughs> and each time you don't answer it, the meow gets longer. <coughs> Let's take this on the road. The early bird gets the barrel. Yeah, yep. Yeah. That's Sunday. Yeah, boys. If it comes down to it, I might have to take an aqua dump and feed the fish. An aqua dump is when you have to poop in the water. What happens to the poop? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Look how serious he was. He's so serious. Vlog. Vlog in the vlog. <laughs> I'm just like the most like. Oh my god, so antsy because everyone's just gonna get out there and we woke up, did all this effort. And like, when Ko is just chilling, waxing his board, I'm just like, come on, we have to go. Where is the best place to go around here? Well, there's a porta potty. We were saying how scary it'd be if you're in a porta potty and someone pushed it over. Onto the door. How would you get out? Headlights. They're called footlights. We got a lot of cats. We're cat people. Look at all the kitties! Yeah. Oh my gosh! Oh, they're so beautiful. Look at their stripes. Oh, they're Keep their cool, okay? There's a lot of cats right now, but we need to stay focused on the waves. Ice bath is like drinking a bullet for your nervous system, but then the bullet is like drinking a bullet for yourself. The double whammy of just high yeah. voltage energy. <laughs> oh, look at the oh, set.
It was pretty good. A couple bomb sets, a couple freak sets, a couple tubes. Good way to start the morning. Took a poop in the lineup. Okay, it's kind of fun. It's not the right direction, really, but I mean, I'd say we took the we took advantage of the opportunity. Hi highlight of the morning was seeing all those cats on the way. In. Oh my gosh! <laughs> He's so hyper. Hey, check this out. Check what I found. <laughs> <laughs> Nervous? My heart's pounding on my chest. The sandbars haven't been like this since 30 years ago. He looks like a GoPro robotic man with all the GoPros in his hands. <laughs> the sand berm is crazy. It's like what, like a 15 foot quarter pipe going straight down into the ocean? It's like a cliff. It's pretty much like it's a cliff. It's a cliff. So, growing up in Hawaii, we played in the sand. That was our big sandbox, was the beach. Sliding down the sand into waves was like the funnest thing ever. Crazy workout, but so much fun. Today, we're gonna do different tools. We got conventional stuggy boogies, we have family boogie, which we can all go on at once. This thing has so much momentum and it's so fast, we're gonna launch. It's like Santa's sleigh. I think you we're get gonna get it? air. I think we're gonna get some air with that it's thing. Like it's like Santa's sleigh gets <laughs> air, you best believe it. You just sit down, you strap in, you go to the moon. This is a blow up cushion, which is meant for sun tanning and relaxing, but also can be used for wave sliding. <laughs> Wipeout montage. I feel like I just ate more sand than any success. It's super cool in the summertime to try to figure out how we can get creative and still have fun, act like kids. Just jump in that child state of mind and just have fun. Like, we're just playing on a little sand hill. We had so much fun. We got a crazy exercise. I was eating Poopahontas. What does Poopahontas mean? Poopahontas is when you're so exhausted that you're Coa's vocabulary. Coabulary. Coa's coabulary. 
<laughs> if you want to download a version of Koa's um, dictionary, it's uh, Coabulary, <laughs> available on Patreon, coming soon. So beautiful. We started the day watching the sunrise on the south shore. Now we're watching the sun kiss the ocean on the North Shore. This is how I'd like to spend every day of my life right here. So beautiful. So fortunate to live here in Hawaii. I find myself not watching the sunset some days. When really it's like, you need to watch this go down. It gives you such a deep appreciation for life and just being alive. Yeah, just super fortunate for sure. If you can, this week's challenge is try to watch the sunset every day of the week. Whatever you're doing, get to that mountaintop, get to that beach, watch the sun go down. I'm just saying, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> if you could go ahead and just scorch the like button like this fire is doing to the palm frond, if you could just burst it into flames. If you could just take it and you could just break it in half and just destroy it, okay? New videos every Tuesday.